Meanwhile, COVID-19 vaccination sites across the state continue to fill up, leaving a large portion of the at-risk population struggling to secure doses. Reporter Abigail Verwick spoke with a local doctor about what he's doing to reach those people. A Chandler doctor's office is determined to reach a population that can be easily overlooked. Um, to get vaccines into the hands of primary care physicians, which is not where they were focusing. They were focusing on this large pod arrangement. Dr. Andrew Carroll says one reason he pushed so hard to become a vaccination site was because he knows many of his patients either do not have a computer or the knowledge to complete the online registration process. I think it's really important. It should be a model uh, throughout our state to get a uh, vaccine into the hands of primary care physicians because that's where, where patients really want get, to get their shots. After struggling to get vaccinated at one of Arizona's larger distribution sites, Donald Mateo and his wife received a call from their primary care physician office. There was a feeling of anxiety that maybe we're running into this barrier that we couldn't couldn't get through it. He's relieved now that he and his wife no longer feel left behind. It was a great relief. It was like terrific. Hey, we you know, and you know, and it, and it was like once that happened, it was like grease lightning. You get to get this thing in, boom, you know, we're, boom, we're right there. The Arizona Department of Health Services says more than 600 providers have been approved and are eligible to receive the vaccine for distribution once more doses become available. In the studio, Abigail Verwick, Cronkite News.